The North Dakota State men's basketball team just earned its fourth consecutive win this past Saturday with an 81-71 defeat of Denver. Valley News Live sports reporter Alex Egan tells us how it was actually a loss to Denver earlier this season that has propelled the Bison to this point. The Bison men's basketball team seems to have found its stride on the back half of Summit League play. We've gotten everybody back healthy and, and it's helped us be able to put together a lot of good practices together as a team. Junior guard Vinny Shahid points to the game at Denver back on January 16th that showed the team's inexperience. We kind of mentally weren't there in the second half and, and that was one of those learning experiences that we had uh, throughout the season. Classmate Tyson Ward said after the loss to Denver, the team was forced to take a hard look at themselves. We came in and we, we sat down and we're like, how bad do we really want this? And we all got in together and we've been in the gym and been uh, together in practice, more collective, and everything's rolling. It really is. Since that loss, the Bison have picked up five wins in six games, with three of those on the road. Head coach Dave Richmond says the way his team is playing now is how he envisioned they could at the start of the season. But it's tough to win early when a team needs to gain some experience, and the only way to learn is to play. We feel like we've got some talent. We feel like we've got some depth. There's, there's good character in that locker room. There's, there's guys that care about each other. There's a tremendous competitive spirit. And um, between the lack of experience, between the brutal schedule that we played early, we knew it was going to be tough. And that's where I'm most pleased you know, with our staff and our guys, that everybody kind of stayed together um, and kept attacking it. That being said, we've got so much left to do here um, come February and March. Alex Egan, Valley News Live Sports. The Bison currently sit in fourth place of the Summit League standings with just five games remaining in the regular season. And DSU returns to action Thursday against Oral Roberts, a team they beat in Tulsa, Oklahoma on January 26th. The win was the start of this current winning streak in NDSU's first road win of the season.